Let's solve a logarithmic equation. I have log of, uh, with base 3, of x minus 2 minus 3 plus log with, uh, of x plus 3 with base 3 equals to 3. Again, in order to solve those equations, logarithmic equations in general, what I need to do is to have log of something equals to log of something. This is important and also the base of the logarithm should be the same in order to drop the logs and set up the arguments equal. So the first step is to combine, using the rules of uh, uh, logarithms right here, the left side. And this will be log with base 3 of x minus 3 times x plus 3. So this is my argument right here. How do I do that? I have a sum of logs and this is going to be the log of product. The rule for that will be log of xy equals to log of x plus log of y. Okay, now the right side. The right side is just a number. I don't like numbers. I want to change this into a logarithm. In order to change this into a logarithm, I need to remember what a logarithm is. A logarithm is the exponent of a number of the base to a specific power. My base right here is 3. So what I need to do is I need to find out what is the number right here that is going to be the power of 3 to the third. Why? Because 3 is the number right here. So I'm going to use my base and my base is going to go here and I'm going to use my exponent that is given by that, and this is going to be here. So the argument of the right side will become 3 to the third. 3, the base, is the base of the logarithm. 3, the exponent, is the number that gives me uh, the um, initial equation that is going to be the exponent of the logarithm. So now I have a logarithm with base 3 equals to a logarithm with base 3. Since they are equal, this means that the arguments are going to be equal as well. So what I have is x minus 3 times x plus 3. And this is equal to 3 to the third. This gives me x squared minus 9, because this is a different squares, equals to 27. And this gives me x squared is equal to 36. The solution for this equation will give me two numbers, x equals to plus or minus 6, because I have to take the square root of both sides and consider the plus or minus for the square root. Okay, so I have two possible solutions, the negative 6 and the positive 6. I need to check which one should I exclude. Looking at the first logarithm that I have in my initial equation, I see that this is the log of x minus 3. Log with base 3 of x minus 3. So if I use the negative 6 in order to check in my logarithm, then what I get right here is the log with base 3 of negative 9. But what I know is that I cannot have logarithms of negative numbers. So this means that I have to exclude this and I have to keep only this. So the right solution for that uh, I get for this specific logarithmic equation is the number 6.